It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new vlog. And I'm feeling sick. I am sick. Actually, God forbid, but I am. <laughs> I am. I've woken up with something. I think Keith has given me whatever he had, a cold. I'm gonna take a COVID test to make sure it's not a Marion virus, but I feel like I'm getting to do now. But am I surprised? No. Because last week I did the absolute, absolute most. And so I'm not surprised because my immune system was telling me, Adela, you and me, you're taking the mic now. We'll see what happens. I uh, had a cup of tea, that feels better. But it's Monday, it's a work day, and so I've got a meeting in 50 seconds. So we move. That is what Adelson looks like. Anyway, in the next 50 seconds, I'm gonna tell you this week, what am I doing this week? I really do wanna put up the Christmas tree. Hopefully today, we're gonna to put it right there. We'll see if that happens today. Tomorrow, I have a PT session in the morning, and then I've got Bible study in the evening, and then work during the day as usual. Wednesday, we were gonna have a work Christmas party that's been canceled. Thursday is just work, but I might be back in Brighton for work. Friday is just another work day. This weekend, I've got Christmas dinner with friends and Sunday is a chill day. So not as busy as last week, but still too busy for my liking, I can't lie. So yeah, let me jump into this meeting. Enjoy the vlog. I'm gonna take a test because this throat of mine, not feeling too good. I will update you with the results in a few minutes. So the, the lateral flow you saw me pull out um, was missing some pieces. Don't know how, don't know why, but I'm feeling worse than I did this morning, I'll be honest. So we are gonna go to the pharmacy and get, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. We're gonna go to the pharmacy and get another one. Also an opportunity to go for a walk, but my chest is chesting. How are you feeling, Key? Huh? Okay. Okay. Like he's not well, people. So um, yeah, let you know what the results are saying in about half an hour. Bye. I'm back, and my test is negative. Negative. We thank God. But that doesn't explain why I'm feeling like this. Well, yeah. No. There's a million other reasons. <laughs> not everything is the c word. Um, but yeah. So no COVID. Thank you, Jesus. But I am not feeling great if you can hear my voice sounds deeper than usual but the show must go on i've actually got a meeting in 50 seconds again um and then literally the rest of the afternoon just carry on working and then this evening i'm hoping to put up our tree like i said so stay tuned for that that's when you'll see me next because i ain't got nothing else to say <laughs> bye i didn't do it i didn't put up the tree i'm sick i'm sick i fell asleep after work then i woke up and then Keith was working late and now it's half 11 and there's no tree. When will we put up the tree, Keith? Wednesday? Maybe Wednesday. Tomorrow is another work day. I even cancelled my PT session and I was actually looking forward to having a PT session, weirdly, like it's been a while. Um, but I've cancelled it because I'm just not feeling well. And so, Tomorrow is a work day, and then we've got Bible study in the evening, so we're probably not putting up the tree tomorrow. Wednesday, oh, I'll keep on going to Brighton on Wednesday evening. This tree just needs to go up. That's me for the evening. Uh, if I could sleep after my two hour evening nap. Um, catch y'all, catch y'all tomorrow. Hello guys, hope you're good. I don't think I've checked in with you today. I'm really sorry, but not been well. Uh, I woke up this morning feeling worse than I did yesterday and I actually ended up calling in sick. Um, I was going to just try and like have a bit of a lie in and like have medicine and it sink in and start work but I got to about 3, four, three o'clock and I started to feel better um, so I messaged my manager like I'm back online and she was like get offline. <laughs> it's now quarter to 8 and we're actually um, doing our, bi our bible study, our bi-weekly bible study with our friends so we are all logged in, I'm eating dinner and um that's it having soup for the soul got a cup of tea 
and um yeah let's get into this bible guys do you have do i have your consent to be my vlog yeah what, what, what are the splits looking like adela say hi bible study hi all right Keith, well, uh, uh, manager answer the question <laughs> what do you say so what are the splits looking like oh no <laughs> if it goes viral I'll, I'll give you a little something <laughs> yeah anyway yeah no, no we can get that anyway that's not yeah gabriel can you say hi because you weren't in it before Babes. hi everyone they didn't take two oh, no just oh. gabriel just gabriel oh, hi, guys. <clears throat> okay that's it thanks Bye guys. Bye. Bye. Yeah. Good morning. It is Wednesday, 6.55 a.m. I'm feeling a lot better today, a lot, lot better. So much so that I didn't cancel my PT session. So my PT will be here any minute. <sighs> I'm not sick, but I'm tired. I'm tired. Um, but it's been a while, so I'm a bit scared. Like, I think it's been like three weeks at least since I last worked out. <sighs> so we'll see how it goes. If you want to see me suffer, stay tuned. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. How are you? How are you? Good, how are you? Good, tired. Same. Alright, right, let's do this. So... <laughs> what, what are we doing today? Um, so, we're going to start off with clean up press. Um, yeah. After the clean up press. Maybe I'll clean up press. Maybe clean up press up on the back, squat up and down. Oh, not burpees, please. Burpees for the whole time. Oh, I really hate burpees with my whole oh, heart. Oh, they love you. No, they don't. So, Wait, is it this? Yep, yeah. all, all the way up and behind you. That's the one, thank you. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you're too hot, come on! Yeah, you can. Oh, it's 10. Yep. Yeah. Oh! Two. Oh, it's too much. Oh my gosh. Oh, perfect. I feel it in my ribs. That's a wrap. Well I just want abs. Any words for them fans? I think you've been doing well. Like, I'm not even just talking for the camera. I actually genuinely think you've been doing well though. Thanks. Obviously there's a lot of things you can improve on. Such as? Eating. You don't know what I eat. I know that I eat well all the time. No, I don't. You're right. Do you think you complain a lot? But I do complain a lot. Do you get the work done? I can so find you once. Check me out. <laughs> Be gains. You know we out here. We working. Nah, honestly though, check me out on Instagram, uh, B E underscore Gains G A I N Z. Um, I want results, so if you're not ready for results, please don't waste your time following me because that's all I want specifically. Yeah, goodbye. I need to go. Yeah. See you later. Oh, you had it first. I work hard. <laughs> oh, get out of here with that. <laughs> I work hard. I don't eat right, but I work hard. <laughs> All right, let's get this day started. It's eight o'clock, eight a.m., eight o five. I'm working from home. All right, let's go. Please accept my sincere apologies. It's been a couple of days since we last spoke. I think the last time we spoke, I was just getting on with my work, and then I said <laughs> we were going to put up the Christmas tree. Surprise, surprise! There ain't no tree. And it's Friday. Guys, this is getting ridiculous. I think that was Wednesday and I'm like, yeah, pin up the tree. And then we were just both so tired. We just didn't do it. Thursday, we were gonna do it, but we ended up actually going to see my in-laws because it was my father-in-law's birthday. And I've just been working and I've just been really tired. Anyways, excuses, excuses. Today is now Friday. And I wanna promise you <laughs> that we'll put it up tonight. And I really do want to. However, it's the middle of the work day. It's lunch time now. So we're gonna jump in a Uber. We are going to um, Anna and Gabriel's house because they need our help with some stuff. And that's it. So Keith is got a day off today. So he's gonna go down and help. And obviously like, I wanna tag along, see my nephew on there. So we're going down there. I'm just gonna go and sit in the office and do my work until the end of the day. But Keith is gonna help Gabriel with what he needs help with. 
And that is our day. So I thought I'd pick up the camera again since something's actually happening other than just us being at our laptops working. And then the plan is to come home tonight and put up the tree. But whenever we're with family, we end up staying late. So I guess we'll both find out together. I've actually got a busy day of work today. So I really do need to, as soon as I get there, lock myself in the office. We're just waiting for our Uber. So lock, lock myself in the office and um, get stuff done. Hello, hello. I have now arrived at Casa de Cu. Um, a bit later than planned, but I tried to do some work in the car yet, but I don't know if anyone else gets this, but like when I'm in a moving vehicle and I'm trying to read or focus my eyes on anything or like write or my phone, I get car sick. So I ended up falling asleep. <laughs> that was a much needed nap, but I'm back now. I've got my double screw and um, I like this office. I like this space, although I feel FOMO because everyone else is upstairs in the cosy living room. But I've got quite a bit to do, so I'm just gonna get on with it. All right. Yep, I got COVID. I am shocked because I am feeling completely fine. I think I'm feeling completely fine. And to be honest, I only took the test because of a work thing I have tomorrow. So you can understand the shock when the the message came back and said I was positive. So obviously we skedaddled out of there because yeah, we don't want to infect anyone or Jerry or my mum or anyone. So yeah, we came back and we were supposed to go for Christmas dinner yesterday with friends. And it's so funny because I shouted at them. I sent them a voice note that morning saying, everyone take a test. Cause I'm not catching COVID again. Hi everyone. Just a quick message to say, yeah. Um, can everyone please make sure they don't have COVID before Christmas dinner because if I recall correctly it was last year's Christmas dinner one of you Scanter came with COVID and gave Keith quote or was it Sean someone gave Keith COVID and then we had to spend Christmas alone just the two of us and I'll be damned if I have to do that we have to do that again right <laughs> right well, we, well, I, we. I, I, and so <laughs> if anyone gets COVID over this weekend that's that's finished for Christmas no family for Christmas, so please, can everybody get? Do you know what? Everyone get a PCR. Get a PCR. They're free, and lateral flows. I'm upset. No, I'm joking. I'm not that upset, but I am because this Christmas we are supposed to be with Keith's family. Um, so I'm gonna be testing all week long, <laughs> right up until Christmas Eve, because I really, obviously, want to spend it with family. But might just be the two of us again. We can make it if we try. It wasn't a bad Christmas, to be honest. It was, it was quite nice, to be honest. Maybe we just, maybe we just spend it together again. It's kind of cute. Um, but yeah, I have no symptoms. I'm absolutely fine. I just have COVID, so yeah, I had to cancel that. And I had a really, I was really looking forward to the thing I had tomorrow at work. It's a, it's a photo shoot, but it was one that I was really looking forward to. Um, and I can't go, obviously. So. Guess I'll just crack on with my work then, shall I? Anyways, do you know, no, not anyways, actually. Let me tell you what my friends did. Keith, in fact, Keith was the culprit. Keith was the instigator, right? When I told them, hey guys, sorry, I have COVID. Keith said, call her the COVID connoisseur. Omicron op, that was Keith. Pandemic player, virus villain, variant vigilante, Pfizer female, booster bouncer, corona culprit, Astra avoider. Those are just some of them is all of the names that they called me so instead of having sympathy on your girl they just proceeded to make fun of me which is not very nice but um yeah thank god i don't have symptoms and i obviously now i know i'm not <laughs> going anywhere moving on to happier thoughts it is sunday and ladies and gentlemen we are finally finally gonna put up this damn tree. Week three of Vlogmas and the tree is finally going up a week before Christmas. I'm not gonna lie, this is not like me. This is not like me. When I was younger and I lived in a house, there were lights up, the tree was up. Presents might have been even under the tree by now. And I feel like as I've been getting older, Christmas is losing its magic. I know Christmas is not about all that, but it is. <laughs> no, it's not, but it's also guys, you know, because I have COVID, I had to cancel my nail appointment. So this is my nails for Christmas. Look how overgrown they are. It's not on brand. Anyways, we're gonna put up our tree now. <laughs> we're done. The tree is bigger, <laughs> taller than we remember. We bought this a couple of years ago. It's a seven foot tree, but 
I'm here for it. Now to decorate. Do you have enough? <sighs> we shall see. We shall see. Let's decorate. <laughs> here we have it. Our tree. It's not too bad. Do you know what it is? We don't have enough. Uh, enough. Last, last year's ones are really cool. Actually, no, that's cute. Can you look? This is the star. If you guys watched my vlog last year, this is the star that I made out of cardboard and wire and gold spray paint. Like, respect the creativity. Close up, you can see it's cardboard far away. Go on, keep doing on us. It looks fab. <laughs> it's not so bad. No, it's not too bad. And that, folks, is all we have time for in this vlog. It is Sunday, it's 6.30 p.m. I've got my mulled wine. We've got Power Book Season 2, Episode 1. Power Book 2, Ghost. Season 2, Episode 1, loaded up. And um, we're going to call it a night. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Comment down below as usual. Like, comment and subscribe. And we will see you in the next one, goodbye from us and our tree. No, it looks alright.